going on guys Mr. Domi here and I got another action figure review this time's on the Hasbro G.I. Joe retro line stalker here part of wave 4 I already did a review on the Cobra Trooper here and uh, I'll put a link up here if you guys want to see that but uh, this is pretty much the two figures for wave 4 nothing really been announced for wave 5 as filming this and so here we go man really awesome we got the ranger here uh stalker he's got a couple uh msgs right there he's got a sidearm pistol and of course a knife and then on the back you do have his bio card and then of course the uh previous uh released figures right here really awesome man and of course he was part of uh you know series one back in 1982 he did just come with a submachine gun but uh he did come in two different card backs in the front he had the uh cobra commander promotion and then for the card back uh he did come in with the nine back 11 back and then of course the three pack from sears which was a box uh three pack you know kind of like an exclusive to sears so really awesome man like i said looks like they're trying to you know ramp it up with the uh first series figures really awesome so there he is man can't wait to get into this so let's go ahead bust him out of the car back and check out this awesome action figure all right guys so straight out of the car back here we go man we got sergeant stalker looking really dope man i love that he could hold both his msgs right onto either hands man looks really awesome i actually I, I really dig this one right here looks really good he does have a holster for his knife and then of course he does have a holster right there for his side arm looks really bad as as you can see right there so let me show you the accessories like i said he's got the two msgs right here so here is the first one nice details and everything it's all blacked out so pretty cool uh, and then of course he does have the second one right here uh, again all blacked out nice details man look at that looks really good and then of course he does have his little knife here uh, lots of details right there as you can see looks pretty good and of course he does have his side arm right here so he's got his pistol looks good again so really nice man so you got a lot of weapons right there for this guy he does have this harness right so uh, you can I, I, I try to look and see if you can actually take it off you cannot uh, but you could probably figure a way out if you uh, maneuver his arms out of it and everything like that uh, but the uh, the scope the paint and everything like that looks absolutely gorgeous as you can see his face Face looks absolutely gorgeous man no errors or anything like that so really cool like I said he does uh, he, you know they, they come with these bases right here so I like these uh, you got the GI Joe logo right there works really well two pegs and then of course you have the two peg holes at the bottom right there for the articulation on this guy is pretty damn good actually so uh, definitely he's got his head swivel right he could look down and not really look up too much but you know he could definitely look down uh, he does have that nice shoulder uh, ball joint right here so that's pretty good he does have a nice elbow joint that's not going to go past 90 degrees but you do have a rotation there and then of course at the wrist you do have a nice rotation and then you have that tilt joint right there as you can see uh, he does have two points right here of articulation onto his chest so uh, the first one he has a upper uh, rotation onto his chest you could arches back and you can bend down but you, you do get that weird gap right there and then he does have another rotation more at the waist right there so that's pretty good he does have a nice ball joint at the legs and then he has that upper uh, thigh rotation and then he is rocking the dual knee joints right here so that's pretty good uh, at the boot right here he does have another rotation and then of course you get that ankle joint right there with the tilt joint so uh, pretty good articulation not too bad like I said man uh, face and everything like that the camel pattern uh like he's got like this sweater so you have like that texture feel onto it looks pretty damn good and then of course uh he's just wearing some uh you know pretty much some some cargo pants right there so it looks pretty damn good man so overall pretty good figure man like i said uh this is you know just these two are the only ones for uh for wave four which is kind of interesting man so uh, i don't know if they're gonna be uh like i said hopefully they announce what they're gonna bring out for wave five uh like i said not really any vehicles for uh wave four either just these two guys right here but uh sergeant stalker man looks pretty damn good i i, I really appreciate this 
this figure right here looks really clean uh, no errors or anything like that and of course the articulation for these guys you know for being three three quarter inch uh, you know scale is is pretty impressive man so uh, there he is man and of course then we have the Cobra Trooper dang so there it is man the two figures for wave four but that's pretty much it guys thanks for watching thank you for the support and i will definitely talk to you guys in the next video